Hello my sewing friends, today I'm going to show you how to do a perfect neck binding using a knit bias state. So if you would like to learn how, then keep on watching. First, measure around the neckline, back and front. Then multiply that measurement by 0.85. And that is how long the bias tape is going to be. And then now it's time to make the bias tape. It is going to be 2.5 inches wide. Don't forget to add about an eighth of an inch seam allowance. And then I am going to fold it in half and press it. And then I am going to fold it one more time just like this and press it again. After that, I am going to match the ends and sew across. After that, I am going to quarter the neckband and the neckline. And then I will match the neckband on the wrong side of the fabric. Be sure that the raw edges are touching the raw edge of the neckline. Then I am going to sew it right in the middle of the fold. Also stretching the neckband as I sew. Naturally, the neckline is going to want to separate from the neckband because it is curved. But be sure to stretch the neckband when you do this. Then I will trim half of the excess fabric right here to get rid of the excess bulk. So when I wrap the bias tape, it's not going to stick out. Now I am going to fold out the bias tape encasing the raw edge inside. Now I am going to top stitch it enclosing the raw edge inside and I'm going to sew as close to the edge as possible. And here is the finished neckline. Have you seen anything so perfect before? Thanks so much for watching and I hope this sewing tutorial is helpful to you. If it did, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and give this video some love by clicking the likes button and leave a comment down below if you have any more questions. I will see you next time. Bye!